Now, guys, there are six characteristics of pressure that you need to understand. All right. Now, these are the golden rules for pressure and liquid, guys. Huh? We are talking only about liquid. Now, golden rule number one for pressure is that pressure increases with depth okay this is golden rule number one huh? now what does it mean by pressure increases with depth guys huh? now, I want you to imagine I have a container okay now, this container is filled with water okay now use a different color pen to represent the water now basically this container has three holes one two three now a b c the water from the lowest hole will move the furthest followed by the second hole and then lastly by the third hole now the reason why water at hole c moves the furthest is because at c the pressure of water is the highest okay so golden rule number one pressure increases with depth now second pressure put gold for you okay pressure in liquid acts the same in all direction pressure in liquid <coughs> acts the same in all direction now I will love to further explain this uh, characteristic in one of my favorite principles over here your Pascal's principle all right guys hold this for me in my upcoming videos I'll explain this in Pascal's principle now the third thing <coughs> that you need to understand okay is that pressure does not depend on the area of its surface okay does not depend okay on the area of surface okay this is golden rule number three Golden rule number four over here pressure does not depend on the shape or size of container. Okay, now golden rule number five okay which is actually the most important rule all right this one i don't want you to forget this pressure at two points okay or oh, at same levels like i said two points of same level okay are equal okay pressure at two points or the same level over here are equal all right this is very important especially when i'm explaining over here how to use the uh, youtube manometer for the manometer example this is very very important now number six okay number six is higher density meaning higher pressure all together one two three four five six characteristics of pressure in liquid that you need to understand okay now in my next video i'm going to teach you the second formula that i've written now the first formula was pressure equals to rho g h second formula is the buoyant force i'm going to teach you everything you need to know about the buoyant force all right